Watch me close. Watch me close now. Who see the red card? Who see the red card? I see the red card. The red card's the winner. Pick the red card, you pick a winner. Pick the black card, you pick a loser. There's the loser, yeah, there's the black card. There's the other loser, there's the red card, the winner. Watch me close, watch me close now. Three card throws the cards light and fast. Three card, that's me, and I'm the last. Watch me throw, cause here I go. One good pick will get you in. Two good picks, and you gon' win. See a red card, see a red card. Who see a red card?
so I'm going to boost this size six and a half, right? Show it to her, she loved it. So I shoved it on her finger. It's a tight fit, right? So she can't just take it off on a whim like she did the last time I did. I'm smooth, right? She out there? Nope. Coast is clear. You boosted a ring. Yeah! I thought about spending my... Take that damn coat off, man. You make me nervous sitting there looking like a spook. And that damn face thing, too. I don't take it off someone like steal it. Well, at least take off that work, man. Yeah. So I'm riding the bus. Really, I only had a minute to make the bus. Wasn't nobody in there anyway. Middle of the week, middle of the winter. Not like weekend. Weekend the place is packed. So I'm riding the bus, right? This kid asked me for my photograph. I pretend that I'm here at first. You know I had a long day. But he just keeps asking. Say the link in the history class and he knew all about it. I mean, he'd been to the arcade before, but for some reason he was tripping. But there was old Aunt Abe sitting next to him on the bus. Now, I wanted to tell him to go fuck himself. <laughs> then I got a real good look at him. Little rich kid. Born on Easy Street. You know the type. So I went to see if he really wanted it. The autograph? Told me to have the 10 bucks. Now, I was going to say five because of the whole link connection and all, but the son made me have the 10. But he didn't have a 10. All he had was a pen, so you took the pen. All he had was a 20. <laughs> so I took the 20, told him to meet me on the bus tomorrow, and I said, it didn't have to change. Shit, shit is bright. <laughs> What'd you do with the 20? Boy, drink that lucky around for everybody. I got a real kick out together. You should've called me down. Next time, little bro. So, uh, you making bookshelves. Out of the milk crates, you making bookshelves. Yeah, that's right, big bro. Make a bullshit. What's the cardboard part for? Versatility. <laughs> uh, I was thinking, we ain't got no bullshit. We ain't got no dining room table, so I'm making a sort of modular unit. Put the books on bottom, table on top. We can eat and store our books. We can put the photo album over here. You sit like right here. And I sit on the edge of the bed. You have the time to do the table like old time. Huh. You gotta get some books, but uh, that's great. Boo, that's really great. Hey, don't be calling me Boo no more, okay? <laughs> you changed your name? Maybe. <laughs> what to? Hmm. I ain't ready to reveal it yet. So you decided on something already? Maybe. <laughs> you better call yourself something African? That'd be cool. I'm gonna pick something that's easy to spell and pronounce, because you know the African names, man. <laughs> I mean, okay, I'm down with the whole. Power to the people thing, but they know one's gonna hire if they can't say your name. And some of them fellas with their African names, no one's saying names and they can't say their names. I mean, you don't want to, you know, handle to obstruct the employment possibilities. You bring them? Shango. That's a good one. Name of the thunder guy. <laughs> I'm just throwing it in the pot unless you decided already, but uh, yeah, I brought Chinese. Let's try to take one. Nah. I buy the food, you set it up. That's the deal, right? That's the deal, right? You like this place? You will cram sometimes though, right? You don't hear me complain. Although that's a kind of boot, boot, right? I'm too old to be sleeping. It's my place. You don't lie to the place. Cookie. She threw you out, remember? You can't seem to get another one. Lucky I let you stay. Every Friday you say, me cop that at your cop. Every Friday you come in with your paycheck. <laughs> it's Thursday and I tell you, brother, it's a long way from Friday to Friday. All kinds of things can happen. All kinds of bad feelings can surface and above while your little brother waits for you to bring me your shit. I got my Thursday head on, man. Go get the food. You don't have to run the water in here, man. So? No toilet, no sink. That one's down You're living in the third world, fool. Hey, I get the food. You playing cards? Yeah. I'll take it. Yeah, that's right. You did pretty good at it. Here's the sauce. Got you the meat. You got me the spam. Yes, sir. <laughs> I wanted this place. <laughs> you 
said you wanted to meet this morning when I left, you said you wanted to meet. Watch me close. Watch me close now. Who see the red card? Who see the red card? I see the red card. The red card's the winner. Pick the red card, you pick the winner. Pick the black card, you pick the loser. There's the loser, yep. There's the, there's the black card. There's the other loser, and there's the red card, the winner. Pop C stick, pop C, come on. One good pick will get you in. Two good picks and you gon' win. Don't touch my cards, man. Just point to the one you want. You pick that card, you pick the loser. Yeah, that's the loser. You pick that card, you pick the other loser. You pick that card, you pick a winner. Follow that card. You gotta chase that card. You wanna hustle three card lines, so you gotta do it right. You gotta break it down. Practice it in smaller bits. You're trying to do it all at once, that's why you keep fucking it up. Show me. Nah. I'm just saying, if you want to do it, then you got to do it right. And if you're going to do it right, you got to break it down. So, we should team up and do it together. We need clean up, man. I clean up, bro. My new name is Free Card. Free Card, got it? You wanted to know it, so now you know it. Free Card, Monty, by Free Card. Call me Free Card from here on now. Free Card? Shit. I'm getting everybody to call me Free Card. Grace likes three cards better than two. She says it's got something to it. Anybody not going to be three cards, get a bullet. <laughs> You're too much, man. I'm making a point. Point made, three cards. Point made. <laughs> oh, come on, man. We could be a team. Make one, yeah. you and me, going down with cards. Three cards and blank. Look at them. You, you be the deal, I be your stick man. The one of the problem looks like just an innocent passerby, looks like just another player, like just another customer, but who's got intimate connections with you, the deal. The one who the cards, the main man. I be the one who brings them into the game. I be the one who makes them want to put their money down. You do your moves out your mind, you turn your head, and that's a more to it than Oh, come on, man. You be a team, breaking the money. She would there be some cats out there with some bad stuff. No, some brothers and sisters who will watch real close and sometimes pick the right car. So some days we lose money. But most days, we come out on top. Pockets, balls, and plenty of cash. We could afford to get laid. <laughs> and great too. We could be all over again. I thought you said she was all over She is. She is. I'm seeing her tomorrow. But today, we got to deliver by the shit she was on me. Big brother Lincoln, little brother Boo. Three cards. Yeah, just give me the dream. No one throws the cards like you, man. When we show moves, my magic, we get grace and a girl be eating around with the posse. We be cold in row, am I right? Am I right? I don't touch the cards no more. Three cards. I don't touch the cards no more. No, mom told me when she was back in the league. You was at school, motherfucker. You was at school. Got up that morning, sat down in your regular place. 
read the cereal box while dad read the sports section, and mom bought you your dick toast. Then you, then you got on the damn school bus because you didn't have sense to know nothing else. You were so into your own shit. You ain't have the sense to, to know nothing else was going on. I had the sense that something was going on, so I went back. Because I felt something. I felt something changing. So I had school like you did on every other She was day. putting herself in bags. She had all the nice suitcases, but she was putting herself in bags. She told me that I should look out for you. And I told her I was the little brother. And the big brother should look out for the little brother. But she just said it again, that I should look out for you. So who's going to look out for me, huh? Not like you, kid. Here I am, interested in an economic opportunity, willing to work hard, willing to take risks. You know, you can say you shit eat motherfucking pathetic limping all the time, or you can tell me how you don't do no more what I be wanting to do. Here I am trying to earn a living, and you stand in my way. You stand in my way, man. I'm sorry, bro. Yeah, you sorry, all right. I can't be hustling no more. What you do all day in your hustle? Honest work. Just look like some cracker-ass white man. Some dead president and let people shoot at you? Sounds like a hustle to me. People know the real deal. When people know the real deal, it's not a hustle. We do the card game, people will know the real deal. Sometimes we win, sometimes they win. They fast, they win, but if we fast, they will win. I'm not going back to that, bro. I'm not going back. You play honest A. You're not going back, but you're going all the way back. Back to way back when folks were slaves and shit. Don't push me, man. You won't have to leave. I'll be going tomorrow. Good. This was only a temporary arrangement. Yeah. I'll be gone tomorrow. Good. Thank you. 